And what we're going to show you guys today is how to place one of the new memory cards inside the PlayStation Vita. Now, as you guys know, for the Vita, you can play games two different ways. You guys can either go to your local GameStop or Best Buy and actually purchase uh, copies of games like this, or you guys can download the same games on uh, the PlayStation Network the same day they come out. Now, games you guys download on the PlayStation Network are a little bit cheaper, around five to ten dollars, depending on the title and the actual cost of it, or again, you can definitely purchase games like this where then you can play some in your Vita, your friend's Vita, or something like that. Now, here we have our PlayStation Vita right on over here, and today what we're going to be going over, as I said, is just where that card is. Now, for you guys to know, there is a, a card slot at the bottom of the Vita itself, but that's actually not what we're going to be dealing with at all and there is a card slot to the right of the Vita, or to the left of it, depending on where you're looking at, and that's actually where your SIM card goes in. So again, it is not there either, and it is actually directly on top of the PlayStation Vita. That's where your card itself goes. So here, we're gonna have ourselves Uncharted. So Uncharted is one of my favorite games out there, one of the favorite franchises out there, and I'm just gonna take that apart. And so far, actually, all the games that I've had on my Vita have been directly from the PlayStation Network itself as well. So I have yet to actually place a card inside of the Vita. Okay. So, as we get rid of the wrappers themselves, there is Uncharted. And if we open it, it's actually very simple. There's the card and that's it. There's really not a whole lot else inside of it. So, we place that down over here. I'm going to take our card out. Again, very tiny card. Or if we can't see from that angle, very tiny card right on over here. I'm going to place that down. And on top of here, just a little flap that opens right on top. And the card itself should, I'll find that for you guys, will point towards you when you insert it inside of it. So the card and the image inside of it will be pointed towards you. And then you close the top part of it. And when you launch your Vita, it'll say here installing Uncharted. And some games have small installs. I think Uncharted has a 64 megabyte install for us. So again, in case it doesn't see over right there. And so what happens from there on is it's done installing it. There's an icon popping up for us. And if we go through our different pages, there's everything we have. And so it just took it to the most bottom page, but you guys can now click on this and actually move it around to wherever it is that you want. So if it you know, should be on another page, you can place it right there. And there we are. And then you can launch Uncharted or whatever that game may be. All right, everyone, so that's just been a short, quick video for you guys and the PlayStation Vita and how you guys can place memory cards inside of it and different methods for downloading games, uh, whether you like digital downloads via PSN or, again, whether you guys want to take the card and actually place it inside of the PlayStation Vita. As always, you guys can find us all over the Internet on different websites, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Flickr, just backslash Sony Rumors, and you'll come to our site. Now, again, if you guys have any questions just or comments even, feel free to drop them in the comment section section below and we'd be happy to answer them for you guys. Till then, thanks for watching.
Alright you guys, so that's been our short little video today on how you guys can place a memory card inside of the PlayStation Vita and some of the different ways that you guys can go on down. <laughs> go